Welcome to Pierce. My name is Tim Smith, National Sales Manager. Today I'm going to walk you around one of our stock 75 foot aerial ladders. Starting up at the front, this is our Impel chassis, which is our very roomy cab. It has a, a front bumper extension that's a 19 inch front bumper extension. It has a front discharge and a front tray that will hold 100 feet of inch and a half hose. As I mentioned, it has an inch and a half discharge. Q2B siren, air horns, and electronic siren. You're gonna notice up in the front, it has all LED light package. You're gonna notice everything on this truck is LEDs, from um, perimeter ground scene lights to all the warning lights. It has the Whalen M-Series LED warning lights. You notice up in the front, it also has a 12 volt um, front bra light and a complete LED light package on the, the roof. All the light package on this truck is a Whalen series. West Coast mirrors. Again, this is our Impel chassis. It has barrier doors, six-man seating. The engine in this truck is the Cummins ISL 450. The truck is all fitted with all our safety systems, so it has frontal and side roll protection. You can notice back in the crew cab, seating for four. It, it does have our raised roof, so it's, it's higher, so entering and exiting the cab is gonna be easier for the occupants in the back. So it's a 10 inch raised roof. The truck is outfitted with air conditioning. Back of the engine tunnel is where you would check for all your fluids, your daily fluid checks. Moving back to the pump. This truck is outfitted with a Waters 2000 GPM single stage pump has three cross lays, so two inch and a half, and a two and a half inch discharge. Right up above here also has a Harrison hydraulic generator, a 6KW. On the opposite side of the Harrison generator is a cord reel. It has one two and a half inch discharge, and you have a two and a half inch intake. Aluminum body, you're gonna notice large compartment on this 75 foot ladder. So someone that wants to run this truck as a first out type piece of apparatus, it's gonna be beautiful because you can run it like a, a pumper. It has large storage or, um, has large storage options for you. Again, it does have roll up doors. As we're working our way back, you're gonna notice that it has in the wheel well here for two scuba tanks storage. Again, nice compartmentation, drop down step that allows easy access up to the turntable. You can see it's a nice ergonomic position going up. Moving to the back of the truck, you're going to notice another big compartment at the rear of the truck. This truck also will have 115 feet of ground ladder storage. So you're going to have your 35 and your 24 on this side and some pike poles, and you'll have your ground ladders on this side, your two 16-foot ground ladders, your 10-foot folding, and additional pike poles. Rear intake, five-inch intake to the aerial. Your stabilizer controls are here. Now on this truck, they're electric over hydraulic, so we simply just push the buttons and um, deploy the stabilizers. In the event that there would be some type of failure with the switch, there is manual backup overrides right here on the step access area and you can manually run all the stabilizers. And that would be manually. Again, you're going to notice on this side the hose bed all sits off on one side of the truck. We call it our Texas shootout. It'll hold a thousand feet of five inch hose. It runs the full length up, so it's very easy to pack in. We, we notch the turntable on that side so it allows easy access, so you don't have to worry about the hose getting hung up on the turntable. Again, compartmentation on this side, scuba tank storage. Also, you, you actually have four bottle storage on this side. And nice compartmentation. The cord reel is enclosed up on site, so it's not out in the weather at all. 
On the officer side of the truck, we have a four inch discharge and a two and a half inch discharge and your six inch, six inch inlet to the pump. Your drains are all cantilever vein, but so it's just a lever up and down, so they're very easy to access and use. And you're gonna notice uh, we have a 12 volt scene light also up high, so it's nice when you get to the scene. On each side of the truck we'll have a, a 12 volt uh, perimeter scene light up high to give visibility around. All this, the perimeter scene light underneath the truck is the lumid bar, so it's all LED lightings up nice and high, so it's protected. You don't have to worry about it being damaged. It throws out a nice light pattern around. The truck is also outfitted with aluminum rims, and it has our in, the TAC-4 independent front suspension. So that's kind of the recap of the chassis. Real quick on the aerial, we do have 12 volt scene lighting on the aerial also. The monitor will flow 1,500 gallons per minute. We have at the end where we can put our life eye option on, so we can hook on the end of the egress section for any type of lifting capabilities. The ladder also has um, LED rope lighting to light up the aerial for nighttime operation. Again, the ladder is high performance, it's a 750 tip load, dry, 500 when we're flowing water, and it'll flow 1,500 gallons per minute, all in a 35 mile an hour wind load. Thanks for taking a look at one of our stock units. If you're interested in any of our stock trucks, contact your local Pierce sales representative.